Well, Election Day is November 8th, it says here, but voters in more than a dozen states are already casting ballots, either at the polls or by mail. And here they are, all the yellow states. It's how they roll. Today, Arizona and the swing state of Ohio join the list. Political experts note early voting matters a whole lot, particularly in the battleground state of Ohio. That's because a third of all voters there voted early in 2012. One third of them, according to the Associated Press. Our Shannon Bream is live. So, for Republicans at least, it's always all about Ohio, isn't it? Yeah, it really is. And, Chef, you mentioned that one third early vote last time. It looks like it's trending the same way, maybe even more. They started today that early in person, no excuses needed absentee voting. And GOP officials in Ohio say President Obama was so far ahead in early voting in 2012. The Mitt Romney could not catch up, even though they say he won Ohio in the vote that was cast on the actual election day. Both parties there realize how critical the early turnout is, so Democrats are spreading the word. This is their message. Vote early, bank your vote, then spend the day, election day, getting other people to the polls. Now, Democrats are outpacing the GOP in absentee ballot requests in Ohio, but the gap is much smaller than usual because of GOP efforts. Another interesting note, in many sections of the state little pockets there, absentee ballot requests for people registered with neither major party or no party at all, actually outpacing both the Democrats and Republicans, Chef. You've been getting interactive with the voters, I'm told. What are the early voters telling you? Yeah, you know what we're saying, if you're going out to vote, vote early. You've got an absentee. We want to see it. We want to hear from you. Just use the hashtag Fox News 2016. Here are a couple of the ones that we got today. This one came in to us from Dave Morrison. He sent us a picture of his mom with her voter registration. He says, my 82-year-old mother registered for the first time in Tennessee to make America great again. She's voting for Trump. We've got another one here, a couple of folks with their I Voted stickers showing us that they are doing uh, the deal and getting it done early. A lot of folks, it's becoming more and more popular. So we're going to use your tweets and your pictures all throughout our coverage and through our election night wall-to-wall -wall coverage. So just use the hashtag Fox News 2016 if you want to be a part of the fun, Chef. And I'm with you, by the way, on the LSU Tigers. Yeah, we're all, well, yeah, that's because you're a Florida State Seminole. You know it. It's not been as good lately for you. I'm sorry. We're hanging in there. Yep, hang tight. Me too.